All right. Good morning, everyone. It is our right, Black Paws back here with you on a very snowy Saturday morning. We are going back into Alan Wake. Now, last time, Alan Wake met Agent Nightingale and ran for his yet. life. Even if it kills me, you hear me? You hear me, H.P. Lovecraft? I had fallen off so many cliffs, it was ridiculous. That's what you get for naming a book the sudden stop. It was probably good I hadn't had the chance to tell Maine where I was going. I'd have to lose the cops and find my own way to the mine. Okay, I got three flashbangs, it looks like. I could really stand to not have taken for a little while. That would be great. There's the train. Okay, so now I have flares as well as flashbangs. Uh-oh. I have a gun. I'm kind of trying to figure out where I have to go. Also, I'm going to pause so I can have a sip of coffee. There was no sensible reason for the power company work lights to be here. It was almost as if they'd been left for someone like me to use. to do it, but I needed to. Okay, 
I kind of need some light here, so let's turn some light on. Okay, I think I'm supposed to go... Am I supposed to go up here? Oh, 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 easy. Easy now. Alright. I don't know if I'm supposed to go up here. I am not supposed to be up here. Okay. Cannonball back in. Ow. Not my smartest move, I freely admit. Okay, what do we got here? We got a lot of glistening things. Batteries. Okay, I'm supposed to be going this way. Hello? The most stubborn man I've ever met. Alice? Alice? Alan. Alan. I'm so afraid. It keeps me in the dark. Please help me. I look at you, Alan, and it's not you. It's something else. Looking out from behind your eyes. Alice, I'm here. I'm so alone here. It's all gonna go to hell. You need to be careful. Cooperate. The connection had been terrible, but that wasn't the only thing that hadn't been right with the call. She sounded wrong somehow, but she had called me. But that doesn't necessarily mean good things, Alan. <sighs> I mean, I, I hate to point that out, but... Okay, there's something this way. Yeah, anytime you see like these yellow marks illuminated by the light, they're usually good things. In this case, it's a whole lot of ammo. Which is good, because boy do I need them. Batteries, flares, I prefer freaking howitzer, but that's me, oh, of course. Just these two. Sometimes you will have traps. Okay, battery needs to get juice.
I could see a railway bridge up ahead and a warehouse of some sort on the opposite shore. I hoped I could find a car from there. Yeah, I'm really not betting the farm on that one. Pursuing me was growing stronger, and it was taking over everything in its path. As a teenager, just starting to get interested in writing, Stephen King had been a source of inspiration to me. I thought about all the inanimate objects that had come to life in his books. No one is safe in a good horror story, certainly not the protagonist. That's what makes them fun. This was anything but. The darkness could possess anything, and it was getting closer. Okay, so we just picked up a heavy-duty flashlight. So that means the beam is going to work better. <sighs> Welcome to the arena. I mean, it's pretty obvious this is going to be an arena. See, told you. Did you call nine one one? Not yet. Scary words again. Let me in. 
Oh! Headshot. Okay, batteries inserted. I'm looking for other stuff. Battery inserted. Gun loaded. In light, you can hurt them. Great. Well, there's light here. the car. Ow. Hold on, backtracking. Okay, I'm maxed out on batteries. Oh, yeah, I remember this. It's the Killdozer! I died. <laughs> okay. So a lot of this is just going to be me running from the kill dozer. Okay, Killdozer is an instant kill. That's why it's the Killdozer. Okay, so... What to do...
I don't need to kill the kill poster. I got the car. Ha 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 ha. So you take the truck to the coal mine. Today, I would meet the kidnapper, and he would give me Alice. I wouldn't give him any other choice. A drowning man will clutch at a straw. Oh good, I get to drive. Okay. Little by little, without realizing it, I'd come to believe that the story in the manuscript was coming true. The current of its narrative had taken me deeper and deeper into dark waters. Alice had been taken from me. Barry was probably in jail. I was a fugitive from the FBI. The whole world taken over by the dark presence was trying to destroy me. It all felt real, but it matched a textbook case of insanity. I got the truck stuck. Because of course I would. Ah. Okay, camera controls are really shit. to any of you who, are, who get motion sickness, but I'm not a good driver when it, in Alan Wake. Hell, yes. <clears throat> Very aware of the hill, thank you. Okay, I am going to pit stop. I was hoping for supplies. I did not fi find supplies. So, me am bumped. <clears throat> but, good to know that Pat's okay. Okay, come on. 
against the mine. Or at least that should be the mine. Sure as hell looks like the coal mine. Mostly, I'm just on a supply hunt right now. I'm not trying... Like I said, I'm not trying to 100% this game. <clears throat> I say as I find a manuscript page way at the top there. Now, that looks like a coal mine. I'm sorry, that looks like a coal mine. <clears throat> okay, I gotta be careful. Yeah, I ain't jumping in there. Nope. Not doing it. Nope, 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 nope. Ooh, can I? No, I can't pop that open. Drat. <sighs> Alright, where's the Jeep? There's the Jeep. Yeah, I traded my nice <coughs> truck for a Jeep. It is the coal mine. I was early. I was supposed to meet the kidnapper at noon in the main building. The coal mine was quiet. It was a museum now. script page. <laughs> and here we go with the cutscene. So basically, we're watching time pass. And he never showed up. Wake! Where the hell are you? Change of plans! You know where Mirror Peak is? It's a big mountain north of where you are. You follow the path from the mine, you can't miss it. There's a lookout point there. I'll be waiting. I'm through being jerked around you by you. You want to see your wife alive? Because if you do, you better watch what you say to me. Do we understand each other? I want to talk to Alice. Yeah, and I want the manuscript. Don't keep me waiting, Wake. Hello? Hello? Ah! I'm going to kill him. All right. <clears throat> We're going to wrap this up here. Uh, so thank you all very much for watching. Hopefully you are enjoying this playthrough of Alan Wake. Uh, it is one of my favorite games because from a narrative and a story perspective, this game kind of redefined how story games are and how a story can really make or break a game. Uh, in this case, it really made a game because Alan Wake is <clears throat> kind of in my view one of the best games of the 360 generation, the Xbox 360 generation. That's how old this game is. This game's from 2010. You know, 
I don't play newer games. <laughs> uh, <coughs> but this is a really good game. I hope you folks are enjoying it. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up here. So thank you all very much for watching. Everyone, please remember, be safe, be well, stay strong, stay healthy, both physically and mentally, because there are a lot of people out there, including myself, who are having issues right now, hopefully not health-related issues. Please be good to each other. Please do the best you can for each other. Please stop the hate. I will see you folks on Monday for Forager, where we go back to the island. Bye, everyone.